how are you doing today? I just wanted to come on and do a quick little video. I'm just about to head out and go pick up the new Jaclyn Hill Vault Collection. I am so excited to review that for you guys. And I have, it's, what well, it was so cool because Ebates sent me this um, email and I've never gotten this before from them. And I, if any of you have, let me know. But I had like 20 something dollars in Ebates and they were going to send me my big fat check is what they call it. And so they said, if you take it in form of a gift card to one of these stores, we'll give you $36. And I was like, ha, that's not hard to figure out. And I'm like, Ulta, thank you. So I have 36 bucks to go towards the Jaclyn Hill Vault Collection and I have been saving it for like, which I'm telling you, gift cards and me, we're not like best friends as, as we hang around for long periods of time. We're best friends and as I love having them. But once I get them, they are like gone. Like I do, they just like dust does not settle on them in my house. <laughs> Especially since I started doing YouTube. So... I just look forward to doing this for you guys and like today I'm feeling good and I was really have been having a really tough week and so I feel really amazing today and so I'm so excited to go out and get it so I'm gonna end up and then I have like $14 in Ulta money right now so I'm getting that for free and then I'm gonna just pick something out or maybe I'll just save the rest I don't know but I'm thinking maybe I'll pick something else out to review for you guys but I wanted to come on and show you this eye look and I wanted to show you how I got it. Um, I did do an eye look video and I mean at the time I'm doing this it's not uploaded yet because I have to join them all together and where I did my full makeup and everything but um, I would much rather show you the eye look complete than show you the process because sometimes with lupus it takes me really long to do it because I don't feel good and um, so I would rather show you the finished product and, but I'm going to try to do it both ways to please everybody and not just think about me, but I got this new beauty yesterday because I had some returns to do and I saved the cashola. I just have this little stash spot in my wallet. If I return something and it's something I've put towards beauty or anything that goes on the YouTube, I set that money aside and I reuse it for other beauty items. And so I had that set aside and this, I was just going to do this video about the palettes that I'm believing God for, the ones I'm really hoping to get. And this was one of them. And so I was at Sephora yesterday and we had done some returns and we go, let's just go over to Sephora and check it out. And I go, Lord, well, if, if it's meant to be, I'll get a parking spot right by it. And I'm like, J or please just provide me a parking spot right by it. And so we pull up and this one guy got the spot right like someone it's like this outdoor strip mall and so this person snagged the spot the in front of me and I was like okay it's all right you guys we'll go another day I'm like it's not a big deal I'm not gonna be bummed I wasn't feeling great so I was like it's okay and then all of a sudden the person decides not to take the spot and gives it to me okay and I have to explain this is so funny no I don't know but I did a video about the Sephora in Temecula and I named the store and I talked about how the manager treated me and in that video I specifically said now I tagged Sephora in that video too so that they would get it they would be note note because that's how Sephora and other sites you have to tag them and do hashtags and stuff for them to notice your your videos and you reviewing the products and so I specifically said about the male manager there that I wish he would have just came up to me instead of looking at me like he thought I was going to steal something, that he would have just came up and if he thought I was going to steal something, hey, the way you stop somebody from doing it is you become their like little, like a little flea. You follow them around the store. Then they can't steal. But I'm like, he could have just came up to me. I'm, I'm never going to steal and I would have gladly shopped with the dude. So, that manager was there yesterday. And what did he do? I mean, the minute I came in, I was standing there looking at the Natasha Denona palettes because 
I got this in the mail yesterday. So I immediately, I got this off of eBay for $55. Thank you. I love Natasha Denona. Love her formula. Love this palette. Wasn't sure I was going to like it, and I love it. But, so I went in, I went on the website yesterday, and Sephora shows the brown in this palette as a shimmer. And it shows it as a really dark shimmer. So what it shows is this brown here, which is a matte, as a super duper shimmer like this color and like this color. And I was like, wait a minute, I didn't think that was a shimmer. And so this is the palette. Just take a good look at that gorgeous baby. But so I was like, I'm high tiling it down there because if I got a fake palette, I didn't think it was fake though because I know how her product smells. It doesn't smell good, I'm not going to lie. It, it has this very distinct scent though. And so when I smelt it, I was like, oh, it smells like Natasha Denona to me. But when I saw Sephora's website, I go, let's go down there. That Now I remember why we were going down there. And so we had run a couple errands, and then I wasn't sure if I wanted to do Sephora still. That's what it was. Thank you. I'm, I'm sorry. It's lupus. I don't always remember everything exactly accurately. So... Since the parking spot opened up, I was like, okay, we'll go in. So I was comparing the palette. I took it out of my bag, out of my backpack. And so he saw me and he did exactly what I said in the video. He came right over to me and he's all, hi, how are you doing today? And he's like, I'm the manager here. And I'm like, I know you're the manager here. And he just looked at me like with this look, like, and he's like, can I help you with something? Are you finding everything you want? And I just was like, oh my gosh. And he was really nice. He walked around and helped me find things. I was asking him, I'm like, sure, I'd love to know. Tell me what the deals are. Tell me what I can't live without today. I'm all sale me some products, babe. Like, come on, I'm here. Let's get busy. And I said, you know, I saw this palette on the sale thing. Could you show me that? And he was really nice. And you know, I am all about second chances, and Just Ann was talking about this on her channel too just the other day, about um, one of the boxes, and she's like, are you about second chances? Well, if you're not about second chances, then that's not very nice to me. I don't think that's a very nice person, because everybody deserves a second chance, even people who are snotty to you the first time, because, you know, you just don't know what a person is going through that day, and... Maybe he was having a bad day. Maybe he had someone else in the store, some lady ripping things off. And maybe when he saw me, he just got, I don't know. I don't know. But I'm certainly not going to hold it against the dude forever. So I got this baby yesterday. I saw it and I was like, this is what I want to spend my money on. Yes, this is it. So with my returns, I got the Violet Boss. And this is called the Rainbow Eyeshadow Palette. And isn't it gorgeous? And so I'll tell you how I started my eye look. So I started with the NYX palette. I wasn't even sure. I knew I was going to do blues today. I wanted something drama. So I started with this as my base and all the way up to my transition. And then it went on a little different than that. So... I went to and I did first this blue and it's much lighter like I couldn't no matter how much I tried and tried I could not get it that deep it just does not go on that dark I may have to wet it or use cap on D lock it to get it super dark but I couldn't get it that dark so then I used the blue which this is a little bit, it is a shimmer, but it's a little bit different blue, so I deepened it with this blue. And then I went to my other NYX palette, and I thought, oh, this color was so gorgeous when I swatched it. This purple here was really super beautiful, and I thought, okay, that's the color I'm going to do. When I put it on my eyes with the Kat Von D Locket, which I used today for the first time in a while, it turned it like a gray color, and I hated it. So I was like, okay, what am I going to do? So I went in with the purple right above it, 
to try and see if that would and then it was just like a big dark blob on my eyes and I was like starting to think oh gosh I'm gonna have to take my whole eye look off and I was starting to get bummed but I remembered when I swatched the Violet Voss this these are super electric I mean bold these colors are bright baby this is not a I'm a shy woman eye look so I took this and put it on top and it gave me exactly the color I was looking for, which is so the Lord, because I just wouldn't have even known to blend those colors together. And then what I did is I just used a basic um, pale, pale pink as my under my eyebrows. And, um, and then under my eye, I did the blue with the purple right on top of it. And then for my crease, or for my inner eye, I took the green, I'm sorry, I'm ha my fingers are so sore. This is actually like a pale green right here, a pale green shimmer. And so that is my inner eye. And in person, it looks like oh, amazing. I absolutely am in love with this eye look. It is super duper bold and in your face for show. But, um... I love it. Oh my gosh. I wanted to do something really bright today because I haven't been doing good and that's just how I am. Like I will try to pick myself up by doing my hair or doing something like just to make me feel good about myself so I kind of get pumped up to, to be up. I have to kind of psych myself out because of the illness. I'm in pain every day. But I just wanted to show you these palettes and this eye look. I hope you guys like it and I hope you appreciate it. I'm trying. I am certainly not some beauty expert and I am never going to claim to be, but I'm trying to do what you guys are requesting and um, I am going to do some of the process, but um, like I said, I, I know nobody wants to watch long videos and I'm just now learning how to um, do time lapse and stuff and so I think that's what I'm going to do to the first one. So. Um, let me know what you think of this eye look, and I love you guys, and I pray that you guys have an amazing, amazing, glorious day, and that you're blessed, that the Lord just blesses you in some special way today. So have an amazing day, and I pray He keeps you safe in this crazy world we live in. Bye!